when you send an email to your customers from your Shopify, it ends up showing something like this kind of store, funny characters and shopifyemail.com and it doesn't look professional at all. And in this video, I'm gonna show you how to change that like support at yourwebsite.com, something like that. So let's get started. Myself Hardy from ecomhardy.com and if you are here for the first time, make sure you thumbs up and subscribe to this channel so you will get notified for amazing Shopify useful tutorial videos in the future. Now let me go to the Shopify admin panel and here if I simply go to the settings and under the settings I go to the notification and make sure your sender email address is selected as your professional email address. If you haven't purchased the professional email address you can use the third-party services to purchase the professional email address and then connect it here. Because your email domain hasn't been authenticated recipient will see your email as store plus funny character numbers at shopifyemail.com for better brand recognition authenticate your domain and ensure your domain has dmark record so what to do is simply click to authenticate your domain so i click on that and just follow these things so what i'll do is I open where I purchased my domain name, I purchased my domain name from the name chip. So I open that and make sure your website is selected. Click to manage and go to advanced DNS. And now under the advanced DNS, you have to follow that steps. So these are the steps. First record you have to add is CNAME, copy. So the host name would be this. So copy that. I go here and under the name chip, in your case could be different domain name registrar just follow the same step go to advanced dns and add the record so click to add new record and select cname because it was showing cname here and under the cname host name host name would be domain key and value would be this so copy that and under the value or target you would type that automatic is selected and save changes same thing you have to do with the second record. So copy that, add new record, C name, and then come back, copy the value and save changes. Now third record, copy C name, target would be this, save changes. Same way, record four, C name, add record, and target would be this, then confirm, and that's it. So once you've done that, what you have to do is go back and click to authenticate domain okay i click that and now it will start authenticating the domain it may take up to 24 hours and after 24 hours it will fix the problem and when you test when you send the email again it will show up from the email address you provided here okay so that's how you can fix the domain name authentication and make sure your business email is showing up instead of funny Shopify email URL. So that's it. If you have any questions, comment me in the comment box below. Thumbs up to this video and subscribe to this channel. Hope to see you next time. Take care. Bye-bye.